Welcome back to Endless Mode. Hi guys, welcome back to Endless Mode. This is Boku Bell. This is Mysterious Gamer X. And I'm Captain Emoji. And uh, we ma we finally mastered combat. combat. Never again will we struggle with combat. Surely. Or maps. We're a reformed... I can't promise maps. <laughs> we, have, we have a new plan, gang. I, I am I am Apple Maps. Oh boy, that's not an Speaking of apples, we are now full up on apple pie. Too. It's true. We are. Uh, apple pie and some apple cider. Uh, we strawberry mm, from Very good number of pies and drink combos here, so Fable is working its magic yet again. Um, and Ready now. To nap. Oh, I, I could <laughs> use a nap, though, is the thing. I could totally use a nap. Um, not sure you what should we're, check uh... out directly behind you for the side quest that probably deals with those bushes. Maybe. <laughs> or not. Where? Where's the dude? Uh, there's those two well, they people were talking. directly behind you. Now they're, <laughs> they're totally, kind of they're perfectly, way. nope. They're the only two people in this clearing. <laughs> right oh. <there. laughs> I was looking for the green dot and trying, I'm trying to use the maps like you told me. Oh, it's the bully! <laughs> He's really How did he survive? <laughs> I don't. He really expects people they recruited him. They're like, "Hey, good initiative!" As he's beating that little kid. That uh, sounds about right, but he's tiny now. No, don't yeah. try to the boy. Yes. That never works well, out. Help he him. can't close his mouth. I'll tell you something that'll really annoy him. Yes. No. You little snot bag. You know not. You be mean be to the. Oh, like he's just a hobo, though. Begging he took an arrow to the. Oh. All the time. Happens to every Different good game. guard. Oh. Heck yeah. Well, I you guess. You know that bully's full of experience points. You've done that already. That's true. But he's older. This I guy's... Big... I was okay. going to say, I am bigger than him. Now. But this guy is older, and he's probably just rich with the experience of life on the road. That's not nearly how experience points work. I think that's exactly how experience points work. He looks more like the straw dummy. should have known better. You're a... Are you going to do it? If you can get oh, into come room. on. Great. Oh uh, yeah! Oh boy! Oh, I got a new expression out of this. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Yeah, See? yeah. Uh, yeah, and I join with wonderful. <laughs> you must be able to get rid of him somehow. Well, I think you're locked out of being a good boy, and now you have to be gross at him. I mean, as far as evil deeds go, this is not. It's disrespectful and unkind. Okay, that's teleportation. Blood and sand. What are the Why are you farting at it? Because <laughs> it offends him. Because I was trying to figure out what the emotes did, so I was just doing all of them. Yep. This, uh, I fucked in your general direction. Uh, you asked for this, remember? I did! I just, you know, I, I, I guess I do prefer to just beat a guy with a stick as opposed to public humiliation. I'm not putting up with this. There's plenty of other places to go. It's bullies Whoa, like look you at that, that make old timers' lives a misery. Uh, you, you millennials! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna write on this on my blog! <laughs> they don't blog! If you see oh, unless their nephew sets not. it up for them. It's always worth stopping. And he's totally gonna blog. I'm sure he's gonna post on a blog. Okay, well, that sounds about correct. Oh, I can't hang around. I've got to ruin his life some more. Oh, come on, buddy. Pick a new target. Wow. Back here. Why are you. Okay. That's a that had nothing to do with those thorny bushes. No, no, that was just a thorny it. social situation. <laughs> Go back. Maybe use your sword right. on those thornies? I tried punching them, didn't do much. The little gold indicators all flashing up in the. Oh, that's just for yeah. the quest for the wasps. Uh, I think that's to collect. No, I think that takes you to power stuff? Yeah. Alright, hero. Hello, uh, officer uh, of the law. Now, my question is, why are all the guards, like, Scottish? Because the voice actor was only in that day? No, no, rich lore time. Let's, uh, let's rich lore this situation. I mean... Um, because they're Scotland Yard? Well, I mean, I'm American's balls, so that <laughs> sounds right. I'm just, you know, I, I, I can't resist a good pun. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, remember this game when we play the others, or remember this area when we play the other games, because it grows. You're it's new very here, cool. You? Uh, yeah. We have some rules around here that you need to know about. 
Is your neck okay? I don't think so. Bowerstone <laughs> is a peaceful town. Uh, it's just a child a weeping in the front of the screen. For now. So peaceful. It's very. Oh no! Peaceful. I think it's like I think it's hide and seek, and he's like. Oh, okay, okay, okay. There are shops, inns, lots of different people, games, <laughs> all kinds of things. They can't take my magic. Away, right? Why not pay the tavern of uh, the first? Can children take it's magic? No, no, I mean, he's, he's confiscating my weapons because it's oh, peaceful. Oh, town. yeah, no, and nobody can take your magic from Lady you. Gray. Lady Treat Gray. With respect. She's wearing oh, purple. She I must forgot be a forgot about her. Well, she's the mayor. Oh, oh boy. This brings back. Enjoy your stay in Bowerstone. You can uh, potentially marry her. Neat. Do I get to wear purple then? Is that how that works? Marrying into the noblesse? I don't Al think alternatively, so. if you're evil, you can fart at her for four minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, is this how this is gonna work? You're both <laughs> different evils. I didn't I see. say I didn't say marrying her was a good thing to do, well, for the record. Yeah. I'm just a bit disappointed in our evil option. Um, Don't we can get a the lot. Homeless guy Listen, a if you want to lure a bunch of children to their deaths to a demon door, we'll have that opportunity. All right. No, no. That's... You okay? Have a have a little faith in bad stuff. Hey, it's it's corn man. Hello, corn man. Been enjoying all the attention, have you? Yes. I heard about your encounter with the wasp queen. You did? Most of I summoned it. <laughs> talking about it. But um. You shouldn't have that kind of thing yeah, so I think head. one of the things you can do is you can hold uh, anyway, up a trophy of something you killed, you and yet. then you can like wave it at people, see, and you get experience for how awesome they think it is that you killed a large bug. <laughs> tell me, how much do you sort of like when I when I kill a millipede in the bathroom and, and come out to, to show everybody Oakville. just what a strong well, warrior well, I am. Well, I remember there was this dude that showed up that probably could have handled the bandits, but he showed up like ten minutes late, even though I'm a child. Yeah, super weird that he was super late to that. Another survivor. God, the chin sack gets me. Oh, and the bully. And the bully. He didn't save the bully. I guess. I thought you should know. And for yeah, of all the people sake, make, boy, it out. make sure you replace that basic equipment while you're here. Maybe you could tell me how. Maybe no? you could give me like a dagger or something, like just any. No. Okay. Bye. It's nice that the Guild of Heroes doesn't actually equip their members. <laughs> no, they just sort of largely send them off to die with a stick and a machete. Of course, you never did equip that katana either. So I can never oh, figure out. Oh God, how. we gotta. Yeah. Swords, axes, shields, probably there's a way. We got it. You're sure to find something to suit you. Okay, so yeah, buy you can buy weapons, you can buy little snackaronis. That's um, fun. When I, in uh, in Fable Two, I got really obsessed with collecting dyes. That's a cleaver. Okay, I can see that. Uh, that was what I just got from those one guys. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have an iron katana. Um, Let me start. And it kind of changes your battle style. If you're a quick fighter, or if you're a strong, slow, smashy fighter, you know, but pretty, pretty general. Iron Great Hammer. Uh, you lack the funds, my guy. I do. Doesn't he have 597? Maybe? Uh, hmm. I don't know. Maybe you lack the strength. Might also be the case. Oh, no, 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 sorry. The red means that it's overpriced or underpriced or something. Oh. Uh, it's what you can buy it for and you can sell it for. You sold your katana? Oh, no, you sold your stick. Okay. Now let's see if it's. What's it... wanted, Nick? I assume that. Means... Oh, it means that they'll pay more for it. Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's like a micro trading system to this if you really wanted to get into that. Um. Tales of High Finance. Tales of High Finance. Uh, yeah. And then in the other games, you can actually, like, forge uh, weapons and they stuff. They don't even let me peace bond it, like, at the Ren Fair. Oh, oh how do you got a whole spawn to hammer. I don't know, but they do it at the Ren can Fair. You, can, you run, can you just run peace bonding by me one more time? Oh, uh, peace bonding is just sort of a... It's a promise that you won't smite anybody with the thing that you're carrying around in your fantasy town. Okay. Um, but it's usually just a zip tie. Now, if it's something like a sword that has a sheath, mm -hmm. you zip tie the sword in the sheath. Mm -hmm. Done. Pretty simple. Mm -hmm. It gets a bit more fuzzy when, yeah, you're peace bonding, you know, 
what is essentially a large blunt object. Now, who peace bonds the Renaissance Fair weapons? Uh, usually the staff. Is there, I mean, is there like a, is there a peace bond man? Usually like their head of security or something. Oh, man. See, I only ever went to Renaissance Fairs in Phoenix, which were great because they had a lot of cactuses. Um, but were perhaps not the most Ooh, authentic chocolates. experience. Oh, and Renaissance Fairs aren't an authentic experience. They're a giant anachronism. Just like the turkey leg. Yeah, we, we mostly just had um, a lot of alcohol, a lot of saguaros, a lot of dust, a lot of sweaty oh, yeah. people Cactuses. in bodices. It was a fun time. It was very, um, second Evil Dead movie. Hmm. Which one was that? Army of Darkness? Yeah, very Army of Darkness. Oh, I see. I think the number in parentheses is their par value. Ah. Okay. Oh, you can buy gifts to sugar people up. We can get married a lot of times in this game. That's weird. Mm-hmm. In the second game, they can run into each other and have um, interactions. You that marry multiple people in the same same area. Oh, it's a little man. It's a little man. He's green. He's got something to say. Oh, God, no, not a game. Thank you for Not your a money. mini game. I mean, you're... Are you guys ever any good at those? Sure. Um, they're fun. Like oh, you can hire a little helper. How much does he cost? What's the going rate for a man, man? Not sure. Um, I would save him for a potentially sacrificial so door in the you future. You know where to find me if you change your mind. I mean, was that a thing? Maybe. Maybe it's my favorite thing in this entire game. Um, well, I think that's up to you. You can talk to the green things. It looks like there was cards, and then there was uh, something in that shop. And yeah, you can you can go to a barber. You can get a haircut right there. Hmm. Um, it's in the back. It looks like it has an icon. Probably See? Bear's yeah. house. <laughs> Bad guess. I'm the man. I'm the man. I'm the man. I'm the man. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you can buy a house. Oh, okay, so that's what that is. Man, I wonder what it costs to buy a house. That's the true fantasy. More, oh, God. That's how you know it's a fantasy game. It's not the giant wasps. It's not the force powers. Maybe try talking to the sign again. I think that was it. For sale. Buy only only 1,500 gold? Yeah, you're, if you didn't go on a shopping spree. Way That's promising. I think I'm gonna have myself a house soon. That was like my favorite part of like uh, Oblivion was home ownership. And uh, when you get married, your spouse lives in the house. Um, the spouse in the house. The spouse in the house. Uh, I will say that the system is a little bit buggy sometimes for marriage, especially oh. if you're having kids. Although I don't think you can have kids right. in this game. Don't break stuff. They don't like it. It's no, not Zelda. No, no, you're not. <laughs> I mean, do actually. You know what? Go for it. Live that dream. Yeah, he hasn't noticed. That's good. Do you want to get a haircut? Uh, sure. Let's do that. Okay. Go back to where you came. Yeah. For a good Thirty seconds. Yeah. Keep going. Is and, that thing straight ahead? Uh, to your left uh, slightly. Oh, big barber. Yeah, pole. the big barber pole. Well, that's anachronistic, but fun. I like it. Hello. I mean, it's Fable. It's... There's more Anna than there is Kron. I would not... I would not worry about it too much. Get yourself a new haircut. Yeah. Look at our options. Look at our beautiful options. Sheriff mustache is pretty good. What? It's a def default. What says default to you? Kind of like the chin strap. Chin you strap. Like old uh, that egg. doesn't give you any bonuses whatsoever. Oh, oh, there's a whole bonus system. I, you yeah, know, I wasn't gonna look attractiveness that. plus forty-eight. Was, scariness. Was... Normal beard is kind of. It's like the Costco dad goatee. You know. It's it's the gamer beard. It is the gamer beard, which is not inaccurate to a good portion. The oh, the basin. trunks hair. That yeah, makes you less scared. It's trunks hair. I I think we got to go for it while we still have hair. While we still have hair. Well, well, yeah. Let's do it. Let's putting it up. And you liked you liked the chin strap. Was that it? I kind of did. 
But I guess nobody else does. Like, as in, like, people in this well, society. Well, it makes you less scary. I suppose you, that's a bonus you, if you're not trying to be scared. You don't have to make anybody like you. It's our fantasy world. Perhaps you needed a tortured farm. What did you oh, oh, boy! Yes! There's a lot going I have, on there. I have combined our two ideas there. Oh. Very handsome. I thought those were maybe things I could pick up, but... No. No nope. such luck. Yeah, different hair places will have more options for you to get get weirder. Uh, but this is a strong start. I think so. Uh, did I have to turn in the quest for the wasp thing? I don't think you have to turn it in. I think it just kind of happens. Okay. Um, I mostly just wanted you to buy weapons. Maybe visit the mayor. Where's the mayor? Behind you. Uh. Mm. Don't go breaking any. Yeah, that coal gate is that glowing blue thing, and it'll transport you to different places. That's cool. But yeah, you can go and try and talk to the mayor. Sure. That perp. That Who purple do you lady. think you are coming up here uninvited? Run along now, Sonny. Okay, maybe not. You don't have eyes. That's their secret. Okay. Justice is All blind. Alright, well. Justice I... is blind! Um. Heck us, I guess. Alright, you wanna. You wanna go out on an adventure? Yes. We'll try cards later, but. Um. Yeah. Lookout point. Heroes uh, Guild, Bowerstone. Heroes Guild. Heroes Guild's what I got. Alright, let's go to the Heroes Guild. Then. Gotta get a new mission. Yeah, I think the thing you're supposed to do next is just go through the forest that you can get to uh, from the lookout point. Wrong, but... And uh, once you get through that forest, stuff will start happening. Okay. Okay. There you go. I hit the same button. I don't know what happened there. I was hitting green skittles as hard as I could, I swear. <laughs> Now that you've described the buttons as Skittles, I can't unsee it. You know, that's what I liked about the Xbox and the 360 was its fun candy colored layout. The color coding was good. Okay, um, if you have some experience you want to spend, I think you can spend it in the, the green area to your left. There you go. Thank you for reminding me. I did say I was just going to literally yeah. run out into the void. Do you want to be a magic boy? So far I've enjoyed okay. it. Okay. Um... Oh, we don't have the don't have the battle charge. Battle charge is kind of fun. Fireball's pretty fun. It's a ranged fire oh. attack. Yeah, no, I like that one. Fling myself at my opponents. <laughs> um, you got a hundred and five strength experience points. Yeah, might as well spend experience some of that strength. Yep. Uh, nope. Never mind. Not enough. Yeah. Apparently. No. Strength is expensive. Ah, you've chosen skill. Well. You could be an expert. I shot stuff with bows. I don't understand. Apparently, not enough. Well, yeah. You got it. You did it enough for seventy-eight skill experience points, but then you spent all your general points. Oh on yeah. Magic. Mm. Okay, so now you can accept new quests. You can either choose to protect or attack it. Huh. Um. I suppose you can scroll down to see what different rewards they give you. But you can lead the bandits 400. to the farm, uh, or you can protect the farm That's for much less money. We're down the same. Uh, difference is morality and money, I guess. Yeah. Being evil gets you more money, but yeah. you know what I'm gonna recommend. I mean, you don't really need money. I mean, what'd you buy? One weapon and some chocolates, pretty much. <laughs> um, what are boasts? It's like going to the Mall of America oh, it's and like picking saying, up a katana. You, know, you can do this without getting hit, or etc. Oh yeah. Take quest and boast means that you can brag, like you can. Oh God, if you're really confident, you can pull it off super well. You can take it in the boast, but uh, I chose it with the boast. So we'll all see right, how bad we'll that see goes. how that goes. Hey, I'm kind of interested though. Um, you guys in the comments, let us know what kind of build you liked. Warhammer. Oh yeah, I think it just equipped automatically, so that's nice. The game realized I needed help. Still kind of wondering how you swap between that and the katana. Well, the knife that pretends it's a katana. I was trying to see if there was a way to switch between them. Can I was you even attack with that? Very, yes. Very slowly. This is going to be super fun. I can already tell. 
I think I need more strength. Yay. I think so, too. I love it. Um, we all gotta get stronger somehow. Wait, hand me that. I'm gonna take a peek in my $2 guidebook and see if there's a way to switch equipment that comes to mind, because <clears throat> definitely can't remember. I didn't realize that uh, it was going to be quite so bad, but <laughs> I've made my choice. I sold the other side. And I, I, you, wait, I you sold the iron to Tom calling. too? No. Okay. Um, so Lady Grey said the opposite quest in the guild yesterday. Maybe I should pick it up. Wait, what? Oh, hey! You're going to lead the bandits? Practicing. You'll need all the experience Whisper, you can get no, you're a good me. person. Apparently Later, not. Bumble. Well... She looks great, though. I still love her more than anything, and I dig the little jean skirt thing. Oh, good. This did remind me that you do get the sexy hero pose later on in life, so... Look, bad guys! You're punching that wasp. <laughs> oh, boy! <laughs> Uh, yeah! Good job! Simple when you know how. Well, I will say it kills bugs dead, but you are one shot in those wasps. And it really isn't killing a bug in one hit the true test of combat. Well, yeah. When they're three feet long and capable of killing a man. The noise they make has has haunted me to this day. Oh well, you did also kill him. You know, <laughs> wide, wide swing arc couldn't help it. That one's on him. Yeah. <laughs> Are you punching his ghost now? No, I just forgot what I was doing. Okay. Gosh. And I mean, I haven't played this in years, but it's cool to see how, see where it all started. Nice. It seems much faster. Probably because you actually spent points on it. Probably. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see Bugs back. Yeah, one little enemy hanging out. Probably eating someone by now. So yeah. Took a while to get there. That's fine. Dragging my two-ton mallet. It's the circle of life. You know, wasps eat merchants, and merchants eat wasps. Wasps. Honey. <laughs> honey. Do wasps make honey? Is that how no. that works? They're fantasy wasps. They probably do. Yeah, I can't argue that point. That's very salient. I mean, fantasy wasps are less jerky than normal wasps. Well, no, they're more well, jerky, but they're also necessary, which is why we haven't exterminated them with lightning. I mean, I don't, I don't know if I believe in true <clears throat> parallels of good and evil in this world, but I definitely can believe in an evil wasp. That does oh, sound man. feasible. Well, that That's that's going to be how I, I denote my good and evil system in a video game someday. Mm -hmm. is well, we've made it to Honeybees, Wood Lake. Honeybees and wasps. I think that's an excellent, that's an excellent system. Oh, oh, hey! Before we get too far into killing these bandits, I think it's about time to wrap up. Well, let's just give it a love tap. Let's give him just a little love. Oh, he's only stunned. You gotta smash him. Well. Like with the hammer. There you go. He wasn't letting me pull it out because you it takes me a, a little bit to do it. Performance you, anxiety. You killed your... <laughs> you killed your first man. Uh, and while you stew on that emotional experience, uh, we will see you guys next time. On Endless Mode. So thank you so much, guys. Bye!